House Democrats are likely to release a smaller coronavirus relief package sometime next week if they don't agree to a deal with Republicans before then, according to a report from Tax Notes on Thursday. I'm talking with my caucus, my leadership, and we'll see what we're going to do, Pelosi said on Thursday, refusing to rule out the possibility of a new coronavirus stimulus proposal from House Democrats. But we're ready for a negotiation. That's what we're ready for. Since the HEROES Act was passed by the House of Representatives in May, several aspects of the proposed relief package will have to be updated, Democrats said. Funding for opening schools has changed, and restaurants will need more federal aid as outdoor seating becomes more difficult during the winter. After lawmakers successfully agreed on a spending bill to avoid a government shutdown through mid-December, Ways and Means Committee member Bill Pascrell Jr. D.N. J. said that Democrats were encouraged that a deal could be reached with Republicans on stimulus next week. In testimony before Congress on Wednesday, Federal Reserve Chairman Jerome Powell again reiterated that, more fiscal support is likely to be needed, in order for the U.S. economy to recover from the coronavirus pandemic. Another stimulus bill is crucial if the U.S. economic recovery is to continue, Powell said, adding that there's still, a long way to go. Top Wall Street analysts have recently warned that the death of Supreme Court Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg, and the ensuing battle over her successor, will further decrease the likelihood of another fiscal stimulus bill before the election. While Trump has pledged to announce his Supreme Court nominee by Saturday, Republicans have already been preparing for a confirmation battle by mobilizing votes in the Senate. Fiscal stimulus is really all but dead, declared Sarah Bianchi, macro research analyst at Evercore ISI. The stalemate in Washington over further economic relief will lead to slower-than-expected economic growth at the end of 2020, Goldman Sachs predicted in a note to clients on Thursday. We now think that any further stimulus will wait until early 2021, Goldman analysts said after they cut their GDP forecast for the fourth quarter to 3%, down from 6%. Stimulus bill before Election Day? Unlikely, Wall Street says Forbes Kudlow, Contradicting other top officials, says stimulus not needed for economic recovery, Forbes, full coverage and live updates on the coronavirus.